Chapman, publisher of Sheen Magazine. And Sammy Haynes, the editor in chief of Sheen Magazine. Thank you again for supporting us. And we are here with Miss Kim Whitley. Hello, how are you today? Comedian extraordinaire. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Hello. I, yes, I am in awe because I have watched you, listened to you for years, and you are a staple and a force to be reckoned with. That's so sweet. Translation. Yes. Use an old bitch. <laughs> 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 but we did not say that. She we, did. Not, she said that. We did not say that. Yes, all. you are a staple and a legend. <laughs> when you are. When they start using them words, I'll be like, bring out my walker. <laughs> Anybody got my insure? No. Insure. <laughs> you are not that old at all. My God. No. no. You look uh, beautiful. You still do your thing every yeah, day. Yeah, absolutely. Well, thank like, you. People should come to you and ask you what should they do to be in the industry. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I try that. to. Yeah, I try to. They do ask, and I ain't never really got an answer. <laughs> no. Well, yeah, I have several yeah. different things, but you know, it happens so fast. Yeah. Life is fast. It is it really is fast. Good. So you just gotta pick something that you like, and just stay in it and do it and have and that, fun. And that's what kept you. That is what has kept you going. Yeah, just, just doing something you like. Doing something that I like, you know, and uh, you know, God is in control, you know. Uh, if I ain't had a Lord in my life, let me tell you something. Oh, Lord Jesus, I'd be messed up. <laughs> um, but yeah, oh that's it. Goodness. Finding something that you love doing because you do it for free and you keep doing it. Yeah. Because yeah. you're having fun. You know, right. it doesn't feel like work. Right. But that's it. But let's talk about these little chairs y'all got. No. <laughs> yeah, let's Why y'all five inches taller than me? Well, you know, I'm going to have to blame Jessica. I'm going to have to. Where is <laughs> Jessica? You need to put Jessica on camera. You all perched in the hard chair. We all in the... Doughy chair. We, we, we want to make you feel comfortable. We want to make sure right, that you know we're comfortable. She magazine is. Oh, don't go to sleep, though. Oh, you want to be me comfortable? I want you. I want you to be awake. Oh, soft chairs. <laughs> I know. You want to switch? I'm in there like this. Uh -huh. uh, uh, <laughs> you want to sit here? You want to sit here? Yeah, I'm about to show you the difference. Okay. Let me show you the difference. So you saw that. You got right? the demo, right? <laughs> now look at the difference. Look how thin I got. Oh, now she will try to look at that. She will try to perch. But look, I'm about eight feet taller than you. Yes, you are. Oh but then again, God. oh no, no, no. Now look. So real now big. I need to sweep. No, no, no. There. I need to sit over there because you're right. I looked a little small and petite, didn't I? Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> yep. Let's go back. Oh, this is oh cool. my God. So I got to ask you awesome. a question. I fell in love with Joshua when I saw the show. And I was like, oh my God, that was an amazing thing that you did. I mean, I know you didn't plan on it, but wow. You took Thank it with you. so much strength. How is Joshua, first of all? Joshua is... Because he's a true... He's he, Joshua's good. He's he's driving and smoking weed now, so uh, <laughs> he's seven. No, he's... <laughs> <laughs> Woo! He's seven years old, and uh, like a seven-year-old little boy driving me crazy. But your face just lit up when we, when he said Joshua. Yes. So he just brings life to you. He is the love of my life. He just like any other man, you know. You <laughs> love him one day and hate him the next. Yeah, that's so true. Yes. But you got to love him. You got to love him. got to love him. Yeah, and I can't do nothing, but I, I love my son. Uh, he's changed my life, and uh, it's, it's been a journey, you know. Yeah. So it's been yes, good. Yes, I know. I have a son. He's 26, and. We have our days. You have your day. Well, Twenty six. Nothing for him. Yeah, I know. All right, you better keep him out the club. I might run up in him. I I mean, right. Not run up in him. I mean, run up in him. I thought it was on him, on him, on him. Oh, cut! Uh, I didn't say that. Uh, we don't need that. That sounds real crazy. Did you hear that, Trey? Oh, that sounds crazy. Where's the <laughs> editor? Okay. Oh Lord <laughs> Jesus. No, I didn't keep I mean, like, say that. Man, should we talk about love? We can talk about whatever you want to talk about. Ooh. Mm. Is there anybody special around the corner, in the corner, in the pocket? That was, ooh, I forgot the guy on the show. Ooh, Rodney, hoping, my baby daddy. Yeah, I was just hoping you guys would just like fall in love and walk down the aisle. He, I, I, I did. <laughs> I was really I'm hoping like shaking. every season when y'all, there were times y'all were like, Really close. There were times like yes. you would tell him like get the hell out. It's like, the real truth. I just I just wanted mm -hmm. y'all to just. Mm -hmm. He is a great father. I yeah. will tell you, he's a great father to Joshua. <laughs> we are good friends. We're on the on the upside now. Uh, Who knows what tomorrow gonna hold? <laughs> but we're doing fantastic. He, he's a great dad, and uh, we're good friends. So I just you know if you ever been with somebody so long, even in friendship. I don't look at him like other women look at him. Other women, they be like, hey. I be like this, hey. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> like I'm over it. It's right. just it's you. Yeah, you know? Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm, I know. Yeah. So <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah. You get over the <laughs> you get over that. That whole thing. So that, that icky feeling. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm he's out cool. of the conversation. I don't know what y'all <laughs> talking about. Honey, uh-huh. she knows, but oh, yeah. <laughs> she knows. Wow. But I enjoy you every morning, too, on the Tom Jordan yes. Morning Show. TGMS. Oh, like, thank wow. you. Wow, good sharing. You Sherry laughing, Shepherd. Like, oh, my God. Especially your motherhood. Like, Oh, that's why we do it. We, mm-hmm. uh, me and Sherry Shepard do uh, Black Moms Matter. Yeah. Uh, especially on Thursday mornings, and we talk about... Uh, you know, just topics that mothers and, and, and fathers, you know, great. come across. Great. And Tom Joyner has been great. The team has been great. And I, I've never done radio like this. So great. it's been a great experience. Right. One thing I ask you about you, you, you stay working. Mm-hmm. That's one thing. You, you don't let too much grass grow up under your feet. You figure it out. You keep working. You stay in front of our face laughing. You keep your face in the camera. <laughs> like, where do you get that work ethic from? That's sweat equity making it happen. Ah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, you know what? <laughs> I call myself a hustler. And I got that hustle from my dad. And my mm-hmm. dad. Who's an architect? Who's right? an architect. Yeah. But, you know, architects, they have to go out and hustle and get mm-hmm. their work. Right, right, right. You know, my dad was always going after the next job. Right. And I watched that growing up. And um, I just, I, I guess that's just in me. And I enjoy it. I, it's like a competition all the time. I like to win. Right. And like mm-hmm. I said, it is something that you, you like to do. And I like to eat, mm-hmm. so you got to you got to work to eat, you know. I know. Right? And yeah, I just I don't know if I've ever been good as a kept woman. I was thinking about that driving over. I was like, you know what? I think about you know, <laughs> and I do. I think about I was thinking about life on the way over here, right. and I was like, if someone just gave me all of this, would it be as delicious? Mm-hmm. Probably not. Probably not. No, it is delicious because I worked for it, right. and it's mm-hmm. mine because. I've had like when you know Wendell on the show. Yeah. Dr. Wendell. Who is crazy? Hilarious and crazy all at the same time. <laughs> but he has been my Hollywood husband. But <laughs> Wendell has given me cars, vacations, diamonds. And I think about really? that. He, oh yeah, people don't even know that. But yeah, he gives me like I was like I say, when do you make it hard for me to get a man that <laughs> because they cannot compete with your gifts. Uh because <laughs> Wendell we can't, somebody I met the guy off of uh uh, not Queen Sugar, Lord have mercy, uh, the other show. But uh, he came up to me and said, Kim, I remember I came to one of your parties. It was in Palm Springs at Wendell's house. He said, and you got a navigator and had a red bow on it. I said, I remember that. That was the first time Wendell, he had everybody come out to this huge party and flew my parents in. And we walked into the garage and it was this big black navigator with a red bow on it. And he said, that's for you. And I was like, well, and he was like, I always wanted to be Oprah. <laughs> So he had his moment. Oh my God. I he gave me this. Met. Yeah, so matter of fact, I'm driving one of his cars now. He gave me a car, but he, he is. He gave you a car. What, what car? Yes, he's oh. always, yeah, and, and, and diamonds and watches. And so I will say that I've, I've had that experience, mm-hmm. and I always think about, you know, well, I have that car, but if, you know, a car, a house, and if a man just gave me that, I would love it. But I think I would get bored because now I'm just sitting in the house and maybe I would probably do, you know, philanthropy and I would, you know, probably, you know, community stuff. Um, but I really enjoy working. Mm-hmm. Um, Sir Tony was just saying in there, I was like, well, you know, I took another day on the radio and he was like, well, what's wrong with you? <laughs> He's like, when are you going to rest? And, I, and all my friends say that my brother, uh, he came to me, he said, Kim, you got to slow down. When are you going to rest? And I said, I don't know if this is going to sound right. I said, but I can rest when I die. Yes. Wow. I said, maternal rest. I mm-hmm. said, but while I'm mm-hmm. living, I want to live. But he was like, you're not living. You work all the time. But see, it's different when you're working and having fun. Right. Just like this. This right. is fun. like right. talking to y'all. Mm-hmm. This is right. fun. This chair is not great. <laughs> but um, <laughs> We're going to get you another chair the next time. I, I hear that every what time. What was fun is all them cute little interview boys you had coming up in oh here, the little know, right? actors and muscle people and Ooh. cutie pies and, oh, honey, that Great little energy, cougar right? in me. Yes, <laughs> Lord. I was, oh, but you know, all these sexual harassment charges, I didn't want to be accused. Oh, they dropping them, love. They know. dropping them, <laughs> and they going to drop a woman soon, so I was like, I don't want to be the first. Not the first. <laughs> They'd be like, you know, Kim Whitley. Yeah, yeah, I did it. I did it. <laughs> 
Oh, you man. Well, me. you tall down. Who is that actor that you tall down at Steve Harvey um, Award Show? I think it was um, the light skin guy. I can't remember his name. Oh, Shamar Moore. Shamar Moore. Yes. Oh, you gave him a lot that day. Shamar gave me a lot. Oh. <laughs> I don't even think he was expecting you. I to was do not that. ready for Shamar's behind to come up on stage <laughs> at the Hoodie Awards. Yeah, at the Hoodie Awards. It was called the Neighborhood, Neighborhood Awards. Awards. Yes. And kiss me and throw me down like it was it was too much. But it, you enjoyed it though, didn't you? You know what? I would say I did enjoy the attention, <laughs> but it it, I, it 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 was a blur. <laughs> <laughs> like I don't even remember him kissing me. Ooh. I went. Did you faint? You went in the I, I fainted. And I, I blacked out. Not because of his lips, because of the 4,000 people watching my big ass about to drop to the floor. I was like, uh, just pass out now. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So tell us right quick some of your new projects that are coming up and stuff we need to know that you're doing. Let's see. I went back on Kirby Enthusiasm this year uh, and did my role as Monina, the prostitute. Um, came back <laughs> this season. Hey, I can't. And when I'm trying to think of other stuff I'm doing, I just do so much. That's Look, awesome. Not really. <laughs> can't do nothing. Just doing? having fun. I am. Uh, I'm on the road with a show called He Said She Said. Yeah. Me and David Arnold, we do stand up across the country. Yeah. So I would love for people to definitely uh, go uh, see that. I'm going to be in Cleveland on April 20th. Uh, doing some stand-up uh, at the State Theater. And I have a t-shirt line that I created for my son who has allergies. Um, and it's called uh, Don't Feed Me, and it's at don'tfeedme.org. And it's an allergy shirt where uh, it says don't feed, and then it has a bl white spot you write your child's name in. Nice. And then it has all these things, and you can check the box that they're allergic to. Oh, wow. Great. Yeah, and I, I created that, and I've uh, been working on that. And just, you know, that's what it is, you know. Wearing new wigs every day. I don't know All right. <laughs> <laughs> new dresses every day. Well, it's Sheen Magazine. It's the beauty guy. So you oh, yeah, wear. Sheen <laughs> Magazine. <laughs> let it shine. Let it switch. Do whatever. I can't, yeah, I can't wait till I get on the cover of Sheen. Yes, and that should be Ooh, soon. Because we can't wait soon. till you come to Sheen Magazine Kimmy Awards weekend. I like the That'd Kimmy Awards. That'd be a Award. great way. <laughs> Is it Kimmy like Kimmy, like K-I-M-E? Yes. Yeah, well, K-I-M-M-I. -I 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 really? Because <laughs> yeah. we want Kim Whitley to be there, to be honored this year. At the Kimmy at Awards. At the Kimmy Awards, which also connects into a cover. And that is a great way to oh, set way into the, the cover, cover to get you into Atlanta. <laughs> to Atlanta. You know Georgia. I'm going to be in Atlanta when? on February. I don't know, early in somewhere in here. Uh, <laughs> I will be in Atlanta at the Comedy Theater oh, nice. in February. I usually come uh, every uh, Is that part of four the tour? Yeah, me, he said, she said, with me and David. Oh, wow. so. Oh, man, we have to come. Oh, I would, that's right. So y'all there, so we got to make sure early. Make sure early. you invite them. February 22nd oh, at the Comedy mm. Theater or uh, in Norcross. Oh, oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I live out oh, there now. Oh, my God. So, well, I'm, okay. I'm out by Norcross, yeah. I'm okay. in Atlanta, but I'm so out by Norcross. Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. So make sure. Let's you know, what's your sign? I am a Cancer Leo. Mm. I'm on the cusp. Oh. Like, I, like I said, July 21st. Even oh. though the internet has me in June, has me in Gemini, <laughs> and all the, the wrong birthday every which way. <laughs> It's July 20th. Anna has me married, so don't believe the internet, first of all. <laughs> it does not tell the truth. It does not. And it has me in a size three. Oh, wow. That's the truth. Yes, it is. <laughs> One leg. Right leg is a size three. Oh. I'm trying I, to keep this thing professional. Don't keep it professional. We like this. Okay, I appreciate that. Why is Niecy Nash's titties out and on top oh, of the Oh, here magazine? we go. Oh, my God. Y'all want somebody to concentrate. I'm trying to say, nah, but, nah, but, nah. and they're they standing there looking at me. And they standing there looking at me. Didn't nobody? <laughs> but aren't they lovely? Oh, so you think on the, on the cover, I'm going to have pasties on. Oh, yes, you are. Yeah, if that's what y'all let Niecy do like that, I'm just going to have mine and have a little pasty on mine. Mm -hmm. This is what we're going to oh, do. Oh, that's going to be a great cover. We're going to make certain that happens. You sure do, but you. <laughs> You, want, you can't show nothing uh, from underneath that. Just that's the pasties. All, oh, that's just it. the pasties, and that's it. You, you can't show the stomach. They'd be like, I didn't know she was pregnant, so you can't show my stomach on the magazine. 
Oh my God. Yeah, it's not you would keep us in stitches yeah. the entire time. Oh yeah. I am tr- I'm trying to have a good time. I'm like, hey, Nisi. That's my friend. <laughs> Very proud of her. Thank you so much for being here. This ain't nobody great. going nowhere. Okay, we don't end of our shot. We ain't <laughs> leaving. We ain't well, we leaving until show. I say we leaving. Y'all done had me up in here eating Doritos and <laughs> chips and cut. cut. <laughs> I'm not going nowhere. And in this dog on chair, just go. <laughs> a little soft chair. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my goodness. She's back in there, I tell you. Yes. Yeah, really, yeah. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. You're awesome. Appreciate <laughs> it. <laughs>